Hello everyone, welcome back to For Real Though Tarot. Today I will be doing a reading on Scorpio. This is your love reading. Please subscribe to my channel. Give this video a like by hitting the thumbs up and also check out my other Scorpio playlist. Again, the cards have already been shuffled. Also, please take what resonates with you. If this video does not resonate with you, you may also check out my other playlist. Let's get started. Okay, so we have the Knight of Cups. So the Knight of Cups represents water signs. And what this card is saying is that someone is about to be swept off their feet. A new lover wants to come in and make you an offer. If you're in a relationship, this card indicates a marriage proposal or a deeper commitment there is definitely a love offer coming your way then I have the eight of pentacles in reverse now with the eight of pentacles it's saying that you're not putting in enough of effort in your relationship there is a lack of commitment and you're becoming bored in this relationship also for some of you you may be putting in too much time at work and neglecting your lover if you're single you're not putting in enough of effort to meet new people then we have the seven of pentacles You and your partner have been working on buying a house together or working hard to pay for your wedding. For those of you that are getting married soon. This can also indicate that some of you might be pregnant and you don't even know it. Then we have the four of wands in reverse. Now for the four of wands. I'm picking up on the X could have caused your wedding to be postponed. Family is also the cause of your union not happening with this person. They are having a hard time trying to get their family to accept the fact that they want to be with you. For those of you that are getting married, this card can also indicate that a reunion has been canceled or postponed with you and your past lover. Some of you have planned on reconnecting with your ex and that has been postponed. Okay, it's what I'm seeing with this four of wands in reverse as well. So we have three of pentacles, four of cups, seven of cups, and the empress card. So I'm showing the three of pentacles in reverse. Now what this means is that a third party may be causing friction in your relationship. The karmic is hating on your union. They're mad because your person wants to marry you and not them. Given the fact that we have the knight of cups and someone wants to offer you marriage. Then I have the four of cups. Now with this Four of Cups, it represents a missed opportunity, regrets, or remorse. Some of you have been reflecting on relationships from your past. 
you're having regrets from your past relationships and you don't want to make the same mistakes. If you're in a relationship, you have become complacent in this relationship or you're so caught up on what you want your relationship to be like that you're too busy fantasizing and not appreciating the relationship that you already have. And that's for some of you. Then I have the Seven of Cups. Now with the Seven of Cups, if you're single, you will have lots of potential partners competing for you. Now if you're in a relationship, your ex will return and cause havoc on your new relationship or current relationship. Judging from the Three of Pentacles card that we have here. Your ex is already causing havoc on your relationship. They're doing everything in their power to prevent this marriage or union from happening. This also indicates that you're not as thrilled about your current relationship as you were before. And you're having doubts because of all of the stress that's going on. Currently, their family nor ex wants to see you two together and now you're weighing your options. So some of you are contemplating on is this a good idea? Should I even marry this person because of all of the drama? Then we have the Empress card. The Empress is in reverse. Now with the Empress it means that someone needs to embrace their qualities. So you haven't been acknowledging your own qualities that you have. Now, you will soon have a lot of people pursuing you, especially your exes. There are some people that don't want to see y'all together. And it's causing you to have insecurities about this relationship. You have been holding back your emotions and you're afraid to open up and tell your person how you truly feel because you're afraid of rejection. If you're getting married to this person, you're afraid they may call off the wedding if you tell them how you really feel about their ex and family members interfering with your relationship. So let's pull some more cards. Oracle cards I have here. Mm. So it's telling you to let go of control issues, allow the situation to unfold naturally. Then we have wedding. This situation involves marriage. Okay, so as stated before, this is a marriage, which this cause just confirms that with this Knight of Cups. Then I have the trust card. This situation is calling for you to have faith. So let's pull the love cards for you in this situation because it involves marriage.
So we have my heart skips a beat whenever I see you. So this person is really in love with you. Then we have I want to make love to you. So this person enjoys making love to you. And then we have I tried to replace you and I failed. You're one in a million. So maybe this person went back to their karmic once before, before deciding on whether or not they wanted to marry you. This could also be the reason why this ex is trying their hardest to break you guys up. And they most definitely do not want to see you together. Okay, Scorpio, that is all I have for your love reading today. Please like this video by hitting the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And check out my other playlists. Also, please read the description below. Thanks for listening, and I will see you on my next video. Bye now.